Welcome back, and we still have persuaded via massage our co-host Tony Baselli <laughs> to stay with us a little bit longer. I barely made it out of the chair. I know you're really like <laughs> you're ready to go back to the chair. I'm ready for that now. <laughs> I mean, golly, it's tough to do to a guy right midday. Mm -hmm. Tony, you've been here since the beginning for the Jags, and decided to make this your home and give back in the community. So we want to talk to you about a big event that you have coming up. Yeah. So can you just explain your foundation and how it works and who it helps out? Yeah. So the Baselli Foundation, we actually started in 1995, and for a long time we. We did uh, grants to different organizations and about almost 10 years ago we started our own after school program. And so we have two sites in Jacksonville, we serve about 100 kids every day, 125 during the summer, and we focus on education and character development. Uh, full time teachers and uh, in some of the tougher neighborhoods in Jacksonville. Sure. We have great kids and uh, we've had great success. Each kid gets an individual learning plan and we help them with their school and making good decisions. We have all kinds of programs throughout the year uh, that are fun but also homework help. And then during the summer, summer, it's you know it's basically summer camp, nine hours a day. So it's now, a lot of fun. How did you decide on that? Because obviously there's a lot of things you could do. Why was that so important? Character development and schooling. You know that kind of uh, evolved over the years of what we wanted to do. I'll be honest, with you, when we started, I had no idea why we were even starting a foundation. Someone, you know, I was 23 years old, sure. and yeah. someone told us it'd be a good idea to give back, and I said okay. And uh, we kind of got our feet wet and stumbled here or there, but then. I knew we wanted to help kids, right. and then being working in the community and seeing some of the different areas of Jacksonville and uh, how great the kids are, we said, you know, we really want to focus on education, mm -hmm. and uh, and obviously, getting education is critical for any kid in Jacksonville. But we all, I don't think just getting education is enough. Learning right and wrong, making good decisions. Uh, we're a faith-based organization, and, and and really giving that foundation, I think, is critical too. So we combine the two. And uh, so this is, this is kind of what we feel like our mission is to do with the Baselli Foundation. Yeah. And you're giving folks a chance to have a good time while supporting this great foundation with the cut party. Yeah. But not the first year. What is it, the fourth or uh, fourth This year? is our fifth year, I fifth. think. Yeah. Okay. So we've been around for a while. It's uh, Friday night of the Players' Championship. Uh, and it's, uh, it's right by where the, uh, the players is, right there in Ponte Vedra. And we have some great acts this year. Mm -hmm. uh, Claire Dunn, uh, Chris Lane, both, I think, I mean, you know better than I do, sure. top 30 hits and, yep. uh, and some up-and-coming acts. So we're really excited. And we always say the cut is one of the best events because we don't ask for any money that night. It is just a good time. So uh, you buy tickets. Uh, we have a bunch of great sponsors. Compass Consulting is our title sponsor. Uh, they're a local company here in Jacksonville. And uh, so you buy your tickets, and then you just have a good time. And so you can have a good time, yeah. listen to music, and know that every dollar we raise goes right back to kids right here in Jacksonville. So it's a lot of fun. Uh, you can get tickets on the thecutparty.com. And uh, so it's, we're really excited about it. We're excited about some of the artists. I think we have some great Claire artists. Claire Dunn, have you seen her play the guitar? She I, is, uh, well, I've listened to her music. Rocks. I like her music. I'm a big country fan. Uh, but I've been told she's one of the she's the best female guitarist yeah. around. Yeah, and so she's we're excited sick. about it. <laughs> can you play anything? Uh, no. <laughs> and sing? I have can zero. You sing? <laughs> I am tone deaf and have no music ability at all. And in fact, I'm a big country fan. Sure. And when we were first married, uh, we my wife and I drove from a wedding in Central California down to San Diego. We'd been married a week, and we decided to drive for whatever reason. And we bought a Garth Brooks. His one of his. Uh, back then a cassette tape, mm. put it in, oh, okay. and I sang all the way down, one of my favorite songs, was, <laughs> and she tried to work with me for three hours how to just sing Friends in Low Places just to get your on tone, tone. Right? <laughs> and to this day, I can't do it. Well, I'm glad she figured out early on yeah. that there are other um, talents you have not that. That is yeah. not one of them. I am not, that doesn't matter in the football field, does it? It does not matter, <laughs> and it does not matter for Friday Night of the Players at the Cup, because no, exactly I will right. not be singing, but uh, we're really encouraging, you know, there's limited tickets. Uh, but we are going to do, and I think uh, uh, Eden and they're going to on the radio station. We talk about it tomorrow. Uh, for anyone who buys tickets this week to Monday, we're going to put them in a drawing, and they have a chance to win VIP access and to meet the artists afterwards. So go to thecutparty.com yep. to get your tickets. Right. So 99.9 .9 Gator Country. We have chances for you to win all, yep. all week long there, and we even have a special River City Live code for you to save ten dollars, and we'll pop that up on our Facebook page as well, so you can be sure that you can save ten dollars. So then it really, the price really comes down. So uh, we appreciate it. They're not expensive it. anyways. The They're not. No, all. it's a very reasonable night out yeah. and for everything that you get from well, them food, a good time. Uh, there's going to be food trucks. So local food trucks are going to be there. Uh, lots of drinks. Adults, 
if you care for adult beverages, we'll be there. That's and why. That's why time. Uber is around. We're ready. Yeah. That's right. We're ready. And it's all for a great cause. Yeah, that's Tony, right. thank Cheers. you so yeah. much. For oh, it's great in. being here. Is, you guys have a lot of fun here. We oh, do we have do. fun. We do. Yeah. yeah. Especially this Are you ready one? for round two massage chair? Well, anytime yes. you guys have massage envy here, please call me. I'd be more than happy. <laughs> oh, okay. He's volunteering for the chair, Rand. <laughs>